4G Steel Fabrication is a structural and miscellaneous steel fabrication shop right here in Lincoln, Nebraska. We do churches, schools, hospitals, buildings for the university, anything that's, uh, that is not a pre-engineered steel building. I'm the operations manager and with that I help schedule deliveries, make sure that we're working on the job, the right job at the right time, so handling with scheduling. Helping manage all of our foremans and, and making sure that all the work is flowing through the shop the way that it needs to be going through. Um, I also do some project managing and then also I'm a majority co-owner of the company as well. Currently we take the structural and architectural design drawings that we get from the general contractors and we start going through them and combing through them and finding all the material that's in there uh, and, and then once we get it all figured out we start adding that into an excel form that we've got created for us that will do the auto sum and total all those weights and everything up. Uh, once we get done with that we start putting some hours to it we try to get uh, as close to a per tonnage cost as we can and then we got to start figuring out what lengths of materials we need that what's going to be nested at us so we can figure in our drop that we're going to have into the total cost of the job as well. Any buyouts we got to start including those into our costs and if we start seeing things with like moment weld prep we got to add some extra cost into those things as well. So it's kind of a time consuming process that you just hope you got it all in there and hope you got it right and, and hope for the best that we're going to hit the time and the hours and the, and the material cost. And we generally do a pretty good job, but there's some times when we've missed some things and, and uh, things don't quite go as well as we'd like. And that's one of the reasons why we'd like to start using the ST model. Well, we currently already model an SDS2. So this is just going to link the estimating with the modeling to the shop drawings, to the CNC files, and then out the door to the job site. So it just kind of puts it all together as one. The connection design is one of the big things because we currently use SDS2 because of that reason already. It only made sense for us to continue using it in the ST modeling. So that way we could have a lot better input and data for our estimates because we can already import those connection designs in there right there at the estimate. We plan to be able to get more estimates out. More estimates out is going to create uh, more revenue for the company. Um, we also plan to be able to find areas that are areas of concern way in advance while we're doing the estimate versus waiting until we start the detailing project and then we realize that, hey, this isn't going to work. 